Yo. Uh, so today we're going to be taking a look at Cultist. Um, this is one that I will not be able to 3-star stage 12, but I can show you the setup and everything for it. Um, Cultist is just one of those stupid factions where you have to have a certain amount of people. And right now I can't 3-star because I don't have Cerberus or Uridin. Um Once I get either of those, it'll be an easy 3-star between having uh, Aatrox and Cyrene out. But we'll go through and we'll just look at the autos of these first two fights. Um, I totally forgot to record them. I was just like slamming them out. Uh, and then we'll go look at the team on the and the builds on uh, after I do 12. But both the runs are pretty much exactly the same. Start out here with uh, Vierna, Cyrene. Cyrene's great to get out early just to get the cost regen going. Um... I faced him down this time, but he's definitely better faced to the left. That was one thing I did notice. Um, he helped me with like the fishes that spawn here. Um, then Ajax, my boy, is just taking down these big guys by himself down here. Just rips them apart. They don't stand a chance. Um, here, I think I used that. Yeah, I used the Vierna ult to clear that. Um, you could also get, the, if you get your Zealous down soon enough, you could pop Aeon at the end during the Zealous ult and just suck them all into the Zealous ult. And that'll pretty much just evaporate them that way. Once again, Ajax go out oh, there. I did that time right there. Um, it's just like uh, it also works if you put her up there too or up here. But I think right here is good because she can maintain healing. And then just to finish off this, Ajax ults all these, and that's the end of this one. Pretty simple. I know it's pretty quick, but. These videos have been like 20 minutes long, so it might be nice to just show you the one run that I'm going to do rather than going through and manualing all three because um, these ones are very similar. Um, not much difference between any of the fights. Okay, here's 11. Once again, it's pretty much all the same except I face greed to the left this time like I was talking about. Um, one thing, too, I'll go over when we uh, look at the fights. Uh, we'll look at Cyrene's build, which is pretty important here, honestly. And if you don't have uh, Yona, um, really any mage up there that gets their ult fast will work. Uh, you have like a Kriya or something, I think it might work up there. I know she doesn't do the best damage. Same thing here, pop the ult, kills everything. She's just so fast with regening that ult. It's great. Ajax goes off. We do the sucky suck. And the fishes are gone. I waited this time to just like absolutely annihilate everything there. And yeah, that's the majority of the run. Uh, Yona will kill these up here. And Ajax will obviously handle all these. I think I actually did, uh, yeah, I pulled, because this one you need, uh, 10. You need to drop 10 units for this floor, so I pulled, uh, what did I pull? I pulled Cyrene, and I pulled Iona, or Aeon, um, just to, so I could drop Cyrus down here, or Osiris, and then I'll drop Aatrox down here. Just so I have the 10 placed. So that's how I finish off this run. Okay, let's go into 12. I don't even have greed full geared right now. Oh, he's got nothing on. So I just did uh, <laughs> 10 and 11 with greed and no gear, so obviously gear is not too important here. <laughs> just that good beer. A... Mine's not even A5 either, so I'm really behind here. So if you have A5 greed, it's super easy. Uh, I guess I'll throw something on just for this. Just for the sake of having him in something, at least. Sure. That'll work. 
<laughs> That's quite funny. Um, her just complete mishmash. She's not really there to do any damage. I just wanted her ult to basically suck them up so uh, Zealous could do all the damage. Um, Ajax, he's in my best. Uh, Soulbound set. High level tier. And then she's got the second best set. Hers is more focused on the rage regen. Doesn't really need attack speed. Another tier. Zealous just full mixed gear. Got him some rage regen. Attack speed doesn't matter on Zealous at all. Um, then just some crit rate, crit damage, and high attack. Uh, Iona's got my only curse set on. This is normally Ajax's gear set. Uh, just threw it on her. Uh, Aatrox in full Night Terror. It's a pretty bad one, too. Um, so, just decent attack. Uh, crit capped, some crit damage. Nothing major on him. He's kind of easy to build. Uh, Hollow. He's in just full attack speed build. He's okay as well. Uh, I don't even have an artifact on her at the moment either. So. And then I think Osiris doesn't have gear on as well. So this one's really not that hard. Um, gear intensive, not much. It's just the mages are kind of harder to get. So if you are unlucky with getting Vierna or you don't have Ajax like myself, um, you might have to do it with some rares, which is definitely doable. Um, just kind of take of where I'm putting the people at. I think the most important units here or Cyrene. Oh, I didn't even show her. I got her in a full tank build. Um, and then you need this Lunacy Visor. Um, it's just to block all those slimes and not let them through. Um, very important. <clears throat> and then, yeah, he didn't have any gear on either. I just placed him at the end. Uh, ideally, Osiren for me would be another fighter. Um, it would let me place down Cerberus or Uridin at the end. But yeah, let's go into this one. So we're just going to be looking to two-star this one, really. Not much else we can do. <laughs> I wonder how much of a difference uh, having uh, him in gear is going to make. I would imagine quite a bit. Yep, everything's dead. This is the one that you want the fast ult with. Okay, Reed's actually handling everything now. That's great. So we'll pop here, and then we'll late cast her ult just to suck everything into the portal. And that just makes it easy peasy. Uh, here we'll wait till everything just kind of spawns in. And everything's dead. So now you could pull this, pull this, and pull this. And then you would drop... Oh, Siren right here would be your other uh, fighter.
and that's it. It's really that easy. Um, once again, I just really have to wait till I get the third three fighters, which is so stupid. These last levels should just be clearing it, not dying, or something like that. Um, they shouldn't be restrictive to what you have and haven't pulled. Especially when there's such a limited pool for fighters. It's like, uh, Aatrox is a newer fighter. He's rare drop rates for an epic. Uh, Cerberus is chaotic, but he's got somewhat rare drop rates for a legendary. And you have Erden, who is an ancient, who you can only get from ancients. So it's, it's really dumb in my opinion. But yeah, um, that's going to do it for this video. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, tomorrow we'll get out the fun one. We got, uh, oh, tomorrow's SO. So I'll probably just redo my SO run with Ajax in it. And then we got two more left between the Watchers and Nightmare. Oh, three more. Watchers, Nightmare, and eventually uh, Infernal. I did get my uh, A3 Pyros yesterday, so Infernal should be going down. All right. I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.